So this is showing how to use the Arbortech Power Carver, which is a great tool for quick removal of wood, uh, similar to a traditional carving chisel. The ends are the same, but instead of hitting it slowly with a mallet, as you would do, you've actually got this machine moving really fast through the wood, so the whole process is quicker. You've still got the benefit of the chisel that you haven't got lots of dust coming off, so it's safer to use. The chisels, when they come, uh, are often need a final sharpening. If you can see, there's some the light shining off some flat edges on this, and you need to remove those so that you've got a really sharp edge to cut cleanly into the wood. So that's the first process that we'll be doing: is sharpening the chisels. This is a, a flat stone. Uh, in, this one needs oil, some of them need water as a lubricant. Without the lubricant you'll find the bits of metal that come off will just coat this and you'll just be rubbing metal on metal. Um, so with this you do a figure of eight pattern like this. With the gouge chisels, you also need to get onto the inside or else you'll have a little curve of metal going inwards. And you need a slip stone for that, which is a, a sharpening stone like this. And you can take that inside there and you just give it a few strokes outwards like that. And that'll just take off the, uh, the inside roughness. And the third stage is stropping, which is where you use a piece of leather with some stropping paste. It doesn't need much at all. And then you just run that across it. And any little sharp edges will get um, rubbed off on that. The other part of maintenance that you need to do is to, every quarter of an hour or so, make sure that there's a drop or two of uh, lubricating oil put in the oil hole here, which keeps the cam lubricated and stops it overheating. So this is ideal for getting into places that you can't reach with the circular turbo plane. Uh, I'm going to work here on this space here, which is a difficult shape to get into. Even with a uh, hand carving chisel, you'd have difficulty because you'd have a mallet that you'd be trying to hit in with. So this, this allows you to get in yeah, very, very easily to very difficult places. So here goes. <laughs> 